Come on, Eddie, your beer's going flat. Hang on, hang on. You'll never win the jackpot. But oh, won't I? Been one before, you know. It's <laughs> quite right. My granddad remembers it very clearly. <laughs> come on, come on, come on. Ah, look at that. Some cherries and two bars. Hey, that, that followed by two lemons and a melon. I, I think we're on a winning sequence here, lads. How do you make that out? Well, the last time they came up, it was followed by the jackpot. Well, put your money in. Go on, put your money in. Now, would you believe it? I'm out of change. <laughs> no, I haven't. How about you, Jacko? I'll have half. <laughs> change? Have you got any change? What for? It's for the... Oh, never mind. I'll get some of the bar. Look, whatever you do, don't let anybody pay that machine. No, all right. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> there you are, fellas. <laughs> And I just went for a coin, and, and I was going to put it in. But you didn't. I put my coin in, and I won the jackpot. <laughs> well, I'll tell you what, I'll, I'll give you a 5p for that lot. Wait, you think I'm stupid? I'd rather take the jackpot, thank you. It, it'll come in handy to buy some petrol for the car. <laughs> what happened to you two? Why did you stop him? We didn't have a church. You know how quick these blackies are. <laughs> Where's my beer? Well, it went flat, so we drank it. <laughs> At our beach. Very nice of you. Thanks a bunch. It's not you and night, is it? It's all Sambo's fault. Eh, uh, watch it, pale face. Oh, knickers. <laughs> You're only jealous because I've got a car, you know. Uh, and what's so special about having a car? The fact that you haven't got one. <laughs> I could have a car if I wanted to. Fact is, I don't believe in them. They're a menace. It could be abolished. But you can't abolish cars. How would people get about, eh? Simple. Bring back the horse. Oh, man, you're crazy. <laughs> I am not. Horses are more reliable than cars. Prove it. Well, for a start, you don't have to have them serviced every thousand miles. And if a car runs out of petrol, you've had it. I mean, you've never heard of a horse stopping because it's run out of oats. <laughs> man, that's the most stupid idea I've ever heard. Anyway, horses don't pollute the atmosphere. You joking? You get a few hundred horses jammed on the North Circular for a couple of miles and you're polluted right up the M1. You've got a point there, Eddie. Uh, see you, fellas. Yeah. Money, 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 share the world. Like a big black creek. Yeah. Very nice car, Bill's got. So, yes, yes, he has got a nice car. Look, will you shut up about Sambo's car? I'm sick of back to the back teeth hearing about his car. Look, Eddie, it's a fact of life. He's got a car and there's nothing you can do about it. Oh, yes, there is. What? I'm going to buy a car on my own. And I'll tell you this, it'll be ten times better than the one he's got. Good help. 